Right, we're going to quickly run through a deadlift tutorial. I'm trying not to be too serious. Um, he's going to be doing the demos. So, first things first, if your gym does have bumper plates, use these because it will help get the ball off the floor, which is going to stop flexibility and mobility being a restriction for the exercise. So, use these plates if you have them, the goes and goes five kilos. The first settle point, so if hip comes in the middle of the ball, you want feet about hip width apart, and the ball wants to sit in the middle of your feet. So, looking down over, it wants to be within the centre of your feet. It's normally somewhere between your laces, if you have laces in your trainers. Next set of point, so when you're coming down, so descending to the bar, you want to start by pushing your hips back over. And then bend your legs. So when you set up in the bottom position, arms should always sit outside of your legs. A good way to actually keep tight throughout the foot movement is squeeze your knees into your arms and it'll create tension in your lower body which is what you want before you actually deadlift you want to create tension through your whole body so if you just push your knee out into your arms then that'll create tension in the bottom before you start moving. so the setup in this position is hips back but slightly higher this wants to be neutral so you slightly tilt the head down i know a big misconception with deadlifts is that you should look up and look forwards you don't have to, just make sure the spine's in alignment before you actually start. You don't want to tilt the neck too much because you get loads of strain in the neck. So just down into that position. So before you pull, a couple of things. Have a little cue is you want to pull your shoulder blades back and down and tighten up like that. But an easy way to do that is pretend you've got oranges underneath your armpits and you're trying to squash them. So if you just relax, squash them. And that's it. And this is really, really tight before you lift. The next thing is when you lift, most people from their lower back will tend to come out a little bit. You don't want that to happen. The way to stop that from happening is if Haley just pretends I'm going to come round and put back up there in the stomach, and you re will really, really tighten that area up. So just pretend someone's going to punch you, tighten up as hard as you can, and as you lift, push your feet into the floor. Go from there, hips forwards, and down. Do one more and stop at the top. So when you're in the top position, as you start lowering the bar, you start lowering the bar by just moving your hips backwards. So if you move your hips backwards, then you start to your legs. And that's basically the downward movement. Come up through one more. And hips in. And down. So you can see as soon as you move, here, yeah, the lower back doesn't come out. Everything stays, stays quite flat. One last round. Perfect, and that's a deadlift. <laughs>